Hi guys, this is Let's Act and uh, I want to make this video to show you how to assemble the Let's Engrain machine. Uh, my English is not good, so uh, so some error may be not accurate. Please follow the video. Uh, first, you should find a flat, uh, uh, flat table and put the four frame, the four al aluminum frame on the table and, uh, <coughs> and use the uh, Use the corner part. Use the corner part. The L shape corner part, and connect them. Connect the four aluminum piece together. You follow the video. And then fasten the screw, fasten the screw and tight, making it tight. One by one. I remember you must uh, you must uh, uh, do this on a flat table, a flat table. This is very important. Yeah, fasten the bolt one by one, and make sure uh, each one connect the other uh, very tight, and uh, no 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 tiny no tiny shape or the no tiny edge between them. You must make them very tight, one by one connect to each other. Uh, one thing remind you make sure the end uh, the end of the the long the long frame the end uh, is uh, uh, is flat you see make sure this uh, this plane is flat make sure the end is flat make sure the end is flat after check the end make sure the end is flat and then you can uh, fasten all the bolt. Uh, make sure all the all the uh, aluminum frame connect to each other very tight. The first step is uh, I think is the most important step. You know all the reel, all the well, and uh, and the X at uh, the X reel. Well, run on this frame. So, uh, the first step is really the the most important step. Okay, the first step finish. Uh, let's uh, let's assemble the X reel. <coughs> uh, you need to find the step uh, step motor and the. To acrylic uh, plate, to acrylic plate, and uh, for for well, for well, for white uh, plastic well and uh, a short belt, and for long for long bolt. <coughs> well, first install install the step motor on the acrylic plate. Let's see see the video. Follow follow the video. And make sure you you fasten you fasten the stem motor on the right uh, acrylic plate. Use the short uh, short bolt and fasten the fasten the stem motor on the acrylic uh, plate. 
Yeah, insert for long boat and a small plastic tube, a small plastic uh, uh, white tube, and then for well, then another for a uh, small plastic tube, and yeah, then fasten, then fasten the boat. Yeah, fasten the bolt with nut. I remember to insert. I remember to insert. I remember to insert the small GT well. That yeah, small GT well on the stem motor, on the shaft of the stem motor. Yeah, fasten the bolt one by one. Use the plier and the wrench to fasten all the boat. Yeah. Use the plier and the wrench to fasten all the boat. Yeah, this one, uh, this part is done. And then we will uh, assemble, uh, move, uh, take the, take the, take the, to the, take the assembled part on the X wheel. <coughs> and insert the the belt. Remember, it's the black belt. And use a small bolt, small bolt and nut, and fasten the end of the the belt. Uh, remember, uh, remember, you must put uh, you must put this small belt uh, inside a little, inside a little, uh, because the belt, because the black belt uh, uh, is uh, not very not very thin. So when you fasten the the two side big uh, ac acrylic plate, uh, it will push. It will put the small boat uh, uh, inside, so you must uh, move the, the small boat inside a little, inside a little, about two millimeter inside, <coughs> and then fasten another, another one. Yeah, check the check the tight of the belt. Make sure it's uh, it's make sure it's tight. Use your finger to touch. Make sure it's tight. And then move this end to the other end to check if it's if it's move if it's move smoothly. And the last step is fasten the GT well, the small GT well. The last step fasten the GT well. And make sure the black belt in the middle of the GT well. And test uh, to see if it uh, moves smooth. A uh, test to see if it moves well. Then this part is done. The next to assemble the two side uh, big uh, acrylic uh, plate. Yeah, fasten the stem motor on the on. The stem motor on the acrylic plate. Uh, you must know the, the direction of the stem motor. Uh, please note. Uh, please note the direction of the stem motor. I put the. I put it uh, like this. Like this. You must. You must uh, put the motor like this, and then fasten the bolt. Use the four small uh, white plastic tube, and fasten the. Yeah, fasten the bolt. Yeah, like this, find the boat. You see the step motor direction. You see the step motor direction. And then fasten the two sides, uh, the little two big uh, acrylic plate on the on the two sides, on the X-view two sides. 
uh, use the, the very yeah use the bigger the big short uh, boat then another yeah fasten the big boat yeah make the make it on the table stand to check to make sure the two side acrylic plate uh, in the same level Yeah, then fasten the boat. <coughs> fasten the other boat. The so next is install the well. Install the 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 very the very well. The small well. The plastic white well. There's totally eight well. Total eight on the two sides and four on the X rail. So totally you have got uh, twelve uh, twelve small plastic well. You install them one by one. One wheel, one plastic, one plastic, uh, one plastic tube and a uh, boat. <coughs> one by one, install them. And then the other side. <coughs> uh, I should that you better follow follow this video to assemble to assemble your laser X machine. Also, any questions you can contact uh, contact us on our website by by email or by Skype. Uh, both okay to us. Yeah, same like before. What is the boat with the plier and the wrench? Then the other side. Uh, this step, uh, no, we do not need to fasten it uh, very, very tight. Just make sure it's tight, it's okay. Uh, because it's uh, acrylic plate, so if you fasten uh, too much, they will break the acrylic plate. Yeah, and then install the, the whole frame, whole frame to the to the bottom frame. Yeah, move. Move to test to see if it works well. <coughs> yeah, the last step to install the install the shaft and the two small GT well. You see the direction must like this, the direction must like this. On the end is a coupler and then a small GT well, then the other side a small GT well. Uh, note, you must make sure the, the two black belt in the middle of the GT well, in the middle of the GT well. Or when it runs, the, the, the belt will, the, the belt will touch the, will touch the, side of the GT well. <coughs> yeah, insert the GT well, insert, uh, no, insert the black uh, belt, insert the black belt. I remember next uh, you need to uh, fasten the two black belt. I uh, same as uh, as uh, as uh, as we told before. You must leave uh, the end uh, two millimeter space uh, because when you fasten the two sides uh, to four feet, the four feet will push the also push the four small four small boat uh, to the middle. So you must leave about two millimeters two millimeter space on the end. Two millimeter space on the end. That means you mean uh, you need push you need to push the the small boat uh, inside uh, about two millimeter. 
you see when I fasten the the two acrylic feet the feet well the, the acrylic the acrylic plate well will connect the aluminum uh, end together uh, uh, so you need to make the small small bolt inside two millimeter all the acrylic plate will push the will put the black uh, black uh, black plate a uh, black belt and the bolt inside two millimeter so you need to leave about two millimeter space on the end you need to move the yeah you need to move the small small bolt and the nut inside two millimeter uh, I'm not sure if you have understand this because uh, my English is really not good so so I cannot uh, maybe I cannot explain it well <coughs> You know because uh, because uh, the black belt have the black belt about two millimeters thick. So when you fasten the side, uh, when you fasten the uh, when you fasten the 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 feet plate, the feet plate will push will push the will push the 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 end the bolt and the and uh, yeah the end bolt and the and the black belt inside two millimeters. So you need to make sure on the end there is about two millimeter space. Uh, for the vertical black belt, because when you fit, uh, when, when you install the uh, acrylic feet, it will push the uh, black belt uh, uh, keep a vertical direction. So that uh, is about uh, two millimeter thick. So you need to leave about two millimeter, uh, two millimeter space. I think you need to make leave two millimeter space. You see, like this, two millimeter space on the end, two millimeter. Yeah, two millimeter space on the end. Because the thickness of the black belt is about two millimeters, so you must leave uh, this uh, space. Yeah, you see like this, the, the feet will make sure the will make the belt in a vertical direction, and the belt about two millimeters thick, so you must leave about two millimeter space on the end. Uh, hope you can understand this. I'm not sure if you have understand this. Uh, because my English is really not good. And now the frame, uh, and yeah, now the frame is finished. And uh, yeah, uh, fasten the the small GT well, fasten the small GT well. Uh, make sure, make sure the black belt in the middle of the GT well. After you check, after you check this, then fasten the small GT well. And test. And move, move the test if it works well. And to check if from this side to the other side, or or uh, the belt, uh, the black belt in the middle of the GT well. Next, install the yeah, install the install the control card and uh, the line. <coughs> and insert the line on step motor. And two small plastic line, two small plastic line, and two small plastic belt. And fasten the yeah, fasten the black, fasten the black, fasten the black tube. Fasten the black tube. And fasten the black tube. On the other side, fasten on the control card. I fasten the control card in the middle, in the middle of the back, in the middle of this side frame. I remember you must fasten the control card on the on the back on the back of the X rear stem motor, not the other side. You fasten the two small bolt. And then fasten the the, the black the black tube. Yeah, like the video shown, like the video shown. Uh, fasten the black tube with the small 
small small white bell. You see the two P line, two P line instead on the right of the on the right of the red 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 button. Yeah, this instead on the X I on the X position instead on the X position the X position. And the next they install the side yeah, side motor. The side motor is also the the Y motor. Yeah, Y side motor. You see on the video, I make the front. Uh, yeah, I make the front uh, uh, a little, a little more, a little more line, and make a little curve on the, uh, yeah, on the, on the, on the right side. Yeah, on, on the, on the, on the left side. Yeah, a, a little curve on the left side. So please keep when you assemble, when you assemble the machine, you must uh, make sure it's, uh, it's same like this. Make sure the end. You see the, the left end, a, a small curve, the line. The line got a small curve. You see the line on the left is got a small curve. Yeah. I mean the way the very step, the very the very very step motor. If you don't give it a small curve, when it moves the the line will block the where the line will block the very motor sometimes. So you must follow this. I use the line on way position. Uh, there are two Y position. Uh, each one is okay. Everyone. Two Y position. Both okay. Both okay. You just need to set the position. You just need to set the position uh, in the software is okay if it's uh, in the opposite position. And then test the move. Then all the assemble drop down. Uh, you uh, cut the cut the useless belt. Cut the useless belt. Cut the useless uh, plastic belt. And then all assemble all assemble job done. Uh, insert the acrylic uh, lead hide holding frame. Yeah. The lead head holding frame. Uh, here you can use some glue. You can use some glue to glue the frame. Uh, on yeah, you to use some glue to uh, to to make sure it stick with the with the X uh, yeah X moving part. But I'm not sure if you need it. But uh, uh, to me, I, I don't think so. Uh, it depends on you. It depends on you. if you need. You can use some glue to stick the uh, the the light head holding frame on your X moving part, and then hold the light head and connect the line. It's done. All job done now. All job done now. All the sample job done now. Uh, my English is really not good. Hope you can understand this. Any question, you can contact contact us via. Uh, email or Skype.